this is one of my rabbits, Daisy. Um, she was the first rabbit that I've ever owned. She's a grumpy little shit. As I've probably said in the videos before. She was in my video on how to set up a rabbit's hutch and all that. She's about three years old. When we bought her and she was a baby, um, she was brown. And then they told us she would end up being grey, which we didn't believe, but this is a grey mound, as you can see now. Her sister was a really beautiful grey and her brother was black. She, yeah, she's not desexed and we're thinking that's why she's always grumpy. She has gotten in fights with my little dog, my white, um, poot, no, moodle, yeah. But it's always her fault. It's always because she's a grumpy little shit. She has a pet ball. That's her best friend in the world. She humps it. Even though she's a girl. But we don't judge in this household. You can see she's getting really relaxed. Her room. Uh, uh, her room. Her hutch looks like shit. Um, I have to clean that today. But it looks like shit because I haven't cleaned it in a couple days and she has rage and so does Pablo, my other rabbit. They're both um, raging, crazy, I don't know. Crazy little shits. I won't show you the rest of the thing because she's torn up the newspaper everywhere and it looks terrible. And it does not smell very good either because she has peed everywhere. That's my dog. Well, no, it's the neighbor's dog. <laughs> oh my god. That's Daisy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, so she's about three years old because I got her three years ago. Um, it's a funny story when we got her. I kind of manipulated my mom into getting her, <laughs> which it sounds really um, crazy and weird. But that's fine. As I said, we don't judge in this household. <laughs> so. I went to the pet shop with my grandma one day um, and I saw this little, tiny little rabbit. She was, she's a Netherland dwarf cross dwarf something else. I have no idea what it was. Yeah, done. Um, we got her from a pet shop called Tails in Aussie. And, hmm, what else? Oh yeah. So the hutch that she was in with her siblings, um, it had like a stand in it kind of thing. And she was the only one that would like climb on top of it and be all adventurous and stuff. So I just fell in love with her. She doesn't really look grey on the camera. Bless you bandit. That's my galah. Yeah, so she'll get cranky if people go near her. Oh yeah, no, no, sorry, the story. Um, yeah, so I fell in love with her and then I, I called my mom and I was like, Ma, I really want this rabbit. Can I get a rabbit? Like, I was so in love with this little thing, this little ball of shit. <laughs> and so I called her. She said, no, absolutely not. So I was like, okay, whatever. Okay, full stop. <laughs> not really. But, and then I went home and then it turns out we needed something from a pet shop. So I was like, Ma, why don't we just go to Tails? Which was the one with Daisy in it. So, <laughs> this is kind of how I sort of manipulated her into it. Um, so, and then we went to the pet shop and then I was like, Mum, this is Daisy. Daisy, meet Mum. And then Mum fell in love with her and she's like, okay, whatever, just get it. I was like, yes, it bloody worked. So, yeah, that's the story of how I got this little, I'm not going to be insulting, this little ball of love. <laughs> My god, she is like the devil. She is Satan, honestly. But she can be really cute. She lets you wrap her in a blanket and hug her and just like if she'll sit on your lap if you pat her. Like my other rabbit won't do that, Pablo, he won't do that. Um, like he'll just wanna leave. But she'll just be like, Okay, I accept my fate. This is what's gonna happen and I can't get out of it. So yeah. She has a sex ball. That's her life. Ah, uh, that was from a kindy. I think I stole it from a kindy, like five years ago. But don't tell the kindy. Maya! 
Maya is concerned. Okay, done.